<laughs> okay, am I starting with the introduction? Or? Yeah, you can go. Okay. What's up, everybody? This is his point of view. Uh, my name is Nganyez Kumete, and I am Lawrence Adams, aka Biggie, the African cocktail. You know, African <laughs> cocktail. <laughs> what? <laughs> you know, mangle mousse. What? A mixture of everything. Are you alcoholic? But I get that. I, 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 I get the job done. <laughs> <laughs> I do the damn thing. So what we're going to do is we're going to ask each other some questions. Very questionable questions. The kind of things that you wouldn't say in front of your parents. Yep. So, yeah, just, just be ready. It's gonna, it might get awkward at some point. Who knows? You're going to start. No, you can go ahead. Okay. Uh, okay. The first one I have is... Okay, the, probably, this is probably the least awkward question of them all. Do you believe in gender roles? To, to a certain extent, yes. yes. How far is your extent? There, there are certain things I believe I wouldn't be able to do mm. that I believe my woman would do best and most of those things <laughs> are kind of like in the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is, this is a confession. That's what this is. <laughs> you know, so I feel like gender roles to a certain extent. I'm not saying that she'd do it all alone. Yeah. What I'm saying is that She'd be bad. She'd be bad. Mm. Yeah. You know? Okay. I, Do you I, believe I, I, in gender roles? Yeah. I mean, it's it's hard to not believe in something you grew up with. You know, if you grew up seeing it yeah. all the time, then it's hard to just sort of be like, eh, yeah. I don't believe in it anymore because I'm a man now and I'm grown. I can do whatever I want. So, I mean, now, as you said, women are better at some things than us. Let's be honest. Tina, Tina we suck at a lot of things. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, as guys, now, Shem. Because I know myself, I like to cook, I like to bake, but yo. You must get your me. stomach pumped after you know that. What I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I might like it, but it doesn't like me. You see what I mean? Okay, here's, here's the question. You, um, does, sexual, does her sexual satisfaction count? Yes, very much. You know, I agree with you on very that. Very much. It does, if you do not care about her sexual uh, satisfaction, but well, you might point. as well use your hand, Chief, because because <laughs> let's be honest, you don't deserve a woman in that case. <laughs> aye, aye, aye. Uh, you don't deserve, uh, uh, you don't deserve nice things. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. <laughs> okay, but uh, what is the weirdest thing you've done during sex? So, <laughs> yeah, this is this is gonna be all for him, really. This is entirely here. Okay, this this, listen, the weirdest thing I've done. Uh, during sex is I've sucked someone's toes. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Was this people? It, it wasn't, no, listen, listen. It was after a shower, number one. And it was like in the spur of a moment kind of thing. I just realized, have you ever seen like you're having sex with someone and then you just see that you realize that something just turns the person on? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. And then, unfortunately, it just, it just happened to be her feet. So I'm guessing they were with my hair. Because there's exactly. no way you were going to... No, like, you know? <laughs> they were here. Okay. So then, while I'm doing my damn thing, mm. I realize when I touch a certain place... Okay. It, you things know, just happen. Things just happen. Things are flowing. Like, ah, you know what? Might as well continue. Because I'm a gangster <laughs> like that. So what is, what is the weirdest thing you have done during sex? That question doesn't apply to me. Why? You have to have had sex before you can do something weird. What? 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 <laughs> Why am I being looked at like this? What I do? It's true. Anyway, I know there's another question in there somewhere. Nganyez is lying. <laughs> Nganyezi is lying. I spent how many days out of seven days with you? A lot. Exactly. Maybe like... And we talk. Yeah. And this has never come up. Yeah, well, you know, a lot of things don't come up. 
That's why there's Viagra. <laughs> <laughs> Zing! <laughs> Zing! <laughs> <laughs> but Nanyas is lying. Anyway, anyway, let's let's move on. No, me, I know things in theory. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Does how much she makes count? I mean, she can't be poor. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, yeah, even her, she must make money. Pearl, how this is not right. But I don't necessarily mind. Me, not personally, because I know you're gonna get touched. But I'm about to say. Personally, I don't mind if my person makes more money than me. Because this is a partnership. You see what I'm saying? It's a partnership, this thing. Our money is our money. And no. either way, it's going to go to things like the house and the cars no. and whatnot. So no. You might as well. Me, me I'm cool. Me, I'm, like, okay, if it's my wife. No. If it's my wife. No. Then, ah, uh, shame. Either way, it's going to our things. No. So, no. me, I'm chilled. No. I mean, how much she makes does count. Yeah. And... I would never allow the girl I'm dating to make more money than I do. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. If it's my wife, if it's your, if even it's your the wife, girl that I'm marrying, I uh, wouldn't allow her to make more money than I do. No, I mean, I, I'm not saying that I would restrict her from doing her jobs and whatnot, but you just personally, me. I would always have a plan to bring back more money than she does at home, for one reason and one reason only. Women love to pull men by their nose and if she makes more money than you she's gonna tell gonna you stretch that nose she's brother. going to stretch it, wear that nose out. she's going to hey <laughs> hey so the best thing is for you to make more money number one and for her to take whatever she earns and buy handbags and clothes and things for the house and every, like you all you do is pay the utilities buy groceries buy school pay school fees like your money is used to pay for everything and her money is used just to eat no, Chief. What? It's a partnership, this thing. Me? No, no, guys, no. This thing is a partnership. No. There's, there's, mo there's money that we both bring in. This money, it gets budgeted. Some of it goes to cars and houses and school fees and, and, and grocery, you know? And then oh. in our money, there's money to eat as well. No. But there's money for everything. There must be equal distribution of money. No. Not equal. Not like that. You know what I'm saying. Okay, we will not finish this. This discussion, but Mina, it's a no. I no. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah. On fleek or natural, which one would you choose? On fleek or natural. Yeah. You want you want his eyebrows with the corners and the and the and the and the, and the ink and the you know when you, when she walks into the sun you start dripping. You want those? <laughs> <laughs> you want those or do you want like? <laughs> Because let's go. Hey, there are some women with no eyebrows here outside. Thank like, you. Oh. Okay, no, my man. No, ne? but it's true. Okay, they my exist. man. Ne? My man. Ne? Mm. I've seen beautiful women uh, who had makeup on, mm. and I've seen women who are beautiful naturally. You understand? Yeah. And they are equally beautiful. You understand? But me now, what I prefer is natural. Because it has always been a thing with me. I've always loved girls who just fuck a Vaseline, glassarine. Mm, that's shine. my thing, you know? Yeah, just shine. Block then, other people's vision you know, when you are walking past them in the sun. Yeah, when I get on fleek or no, Mina, natural. No, Mina, yes, I don't mind makeup, ne? Yeah. Just don't wear black lipstick. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! That thing offends my soul. Black lipstick! No, black lipstick is offensive, guys. Black lipstick was made by people who wanted you to never fall in love. <laughs> That's your problem. Then you're going to walk outside and look like you clean the streets with your mouth. <laughs> uh, a sis. Aye. Aye, aye, aye. Mm. Black oh, lipstick is disgusting. Oh, 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 she, blow, uh, she blows out br bright stands for you. Know? <laughs> <laughs> no, her mouth, her mouth is the disposer for the charcoal. That's what it looks like. Aye, sis, black lipstick is nasty. Okay. Otherwise, natural hair is amazing. Yeah, na natural, natural hair yeah. with its roundness. Yeah. Oh, aye, it's beautiful. Yeah, no, I agree. Aye, it's gorgeous. So, um, beauty or braids? Aye, Pella, both are important. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> both, both are very key, you yes. know? Because yes. uh, equally, it doesn't matter how smart someone is. If I look at you and I'm like, aye, Marawena. But, 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 but. Mm. but if you had to choose only one beauty operates. If I had to choose one, 
for one night, beauty. If I had to choose one, for like the rest of my life, brains. Okay. Yeah. No, I agree with you on that one. I agree. I agree. That you gotta, you gotta put these things in terms and conditions. Yeah. Otherwise, you will lose, Baba, at life. Yeah, you, no. You, you, you. Uh, Brains, mm -hmm. brains over beauty in the long run. Yeah. In the short run. I beauty is fine. I'm a no faith. I fail. I'm a no faith. Oh. Yeah, Zin. That's what Rima Banya Bantua and then she can also. Hey, they're not good. They're not good. Oh, because apparently it's a sensitive what what. Do men believe in platonic relationships? Yeah. I do believe in platonic relationships. Do I you? do. I do. I do very much. I have, I have a friend, ne? that I met in first year, 2015. This girl, she legit became like me and her. We were like waffles and ice cream. Just inseparable. Yeah. Okay. You know, and she's, she's, we never dated. We never, you know, to this day, I still call her my twin because we had so much in common, me and her. Oh. And we still have so much in common. So me, I very much believe in platonic relationships. No, I do too. I think, I think, I think platonic relationships are the best. Yeah. And also, Manai, you don't have to date. You, you don't have to date every girl that you meet. Yeah, because you hey, you'll get some tired, girls. I you know. just, I just good to be friends with. I understand. We won't mention names, but you know yourselves. <laughs> <laughs> you know yourselves. I shame. I, I, some people just in friend zone is where you were meant to be. What? Yeah, no, you were some born, people for, born it. for the friend zone. Yeah. Not, otherwise, Made I, for it. you know, you yeah, yeah. When yeah, yes. So this is the question. Why does size matter? Why? Yeah. Why does size matter? Because, I don't know. I mean, you can't put a... Okay, wait. I'm coming. <laughs> Not like that. Not like that. <laughs> Not like that. I, I meant the answer's coming. <laughs> Whoa. Wow. <laughs> sure. <laughs> no, what I meant? Okay. Wow. wow. Never mind. No, woo. Need to okay. rethink that. The answer was coming. Okay. And now the answer is, you can't you can't have a large family and make them watch a small TV. Oh. You see what I'm saying? Because okay. then some people can't see, you know. Yeah. So let's rather get, you know, big things. It's be right. Oh. Okay. Unless, yeah. I don't know what else. What in terms of, yeah. I'll get, yeah. I'll get what I'm trying to say. Yeah, no, me too. I do believe that uh, the reason why size matters mm. is because if, if you do not have sufficient size, you are supposed to do more work. <laughs> <laughs> so you are lazy. That's your problem. You are lazy. <laughs> <laughs> so if you are, you know, if your member is, mm. is you know, somewhere okay. around here in the, in the deprived stages yes you understand yeah that means you must learn how to ream you know <laughs> how to <laughs> you gotta do you, you gotta you need to get a phd <laughs> before you can start working you understand <laughs> so if, if if member is quite big in dana you know you don't have to do that much of work you understand? all you have to know is how to stroke right essentially what you're saying is it's the difference between having connections in the workplace yeah. And not having connections. Exactly. When you don't have connections, you have you, to study more. You understand. When you have connections, you just have you now. You come know? there with your metric certificate and, and, what's, and, and you manage. just you see what I'm saying? Exactly. Everything is good and yeah. you're getting rewards. Babo? On top of rewards. You know? Even those <laughs> Ah yes. Took a while. <laughs> Took a while. Ah, I get geez. you. I get you, Tanayam. <laughs> I get you. Yeah. Okay. Uh okay, me, I'm out of questions. Oh, you are? Yeah. Oh, yeah, there's, there's one more. Uh, would you want to know how many guys a girl you're dating has been intimate with? For what? And right. Like if, 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 if you just sit down and you I've had sex with 10 guys. In my no, why is she telling me? What must I do with that information? <laughs> <laughs> must I take them back? I, I, what? <laughs> what must I do with that information? <laughs> I, 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 I'm fine. Yeah, no, I, don't I, need to I, know. I agree. I agree that it's none of my business. Yeah. That's your business. Um, I don't want to know how many people you have slept with. Hmm. I'm cool not knowing. But yeah. there are things I need to know. If you have ever been a man, I need to know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. 
If you have been important. a slay queen, I need to know. If someone has taken you to Dubai, I need to hey, know. Hey, that one is key. If you love sitting in the front seat of cars that are not your father's, I need to know. <laughs> I need to know. <laughs> you are sitting in the front. <laughs> yo, 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 yo. Okay, yeah. Is that all the questions? Yeah, that's it. Yeah. We are done. Yeah. How do you... Oh, wait, there's one I missed. Jeez, that's awkward. Anyway, how do you feel when she calls you daddy? Ooh. Ooh. How do I feel when she calls me daddy? Mm. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, it's amazing. <laughs> It's that damn thing. Uh, it's garlic bread. It's garlic bread. <laughs> <laughs> it's garlic bread. Hey, nothing's better than garlic bread. Yeah. No, me, I no, don't no, like no, it. Being, being called daddy. Mm -mm. No, What's not father daddy, am I? But yeah, daddy. Yeah, mm -mm. No, I'm fine. And right. Mm, right. Mm. Has, like, or, or she calls you big daddy. Ooh. Okay, yeah, that's different. <laughs> <laughs> See, that is why size matters. That's why size matters. Yeah, yes. Imagine if she called you small daddy. Sure. No, no, no. Then we have a problem here. You yeah, see? So, then so, we have a problem. Okay, me, I'm cool with her calling me daddy, big daddy. Uh, just don't call me baby, honey, love, sweetheart. What else? So, all the normal things. Yeah, no. Bolavi. No. Sure. It makes me. It makes you seem like oh. you know what, dad, daddy, and big daddy, mm. automatically mm. makes everyone who's in the room understand who she's speaking to. If she calls and say hi, daddy. No, but a big daddy, baba. Yeah, big, big daddy is the one. <laughs> oh, big daddy is the one. No, big that, daddy. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? She has to specify the size of the daddy. You know what I'm saying? That is very key. That is very very key. That one. Yeah, she must... on, on 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 that, ne? Mm. Would you mind? Your girlfriend naming your member. Yes. Why? It's mine. Why are you naming it? Okay, so if you had to name yours, what would you call it? I wouldn't. I wouldn't name it. Why must it have a name? Just to, to be kinky, dog. Just to be, you know, a bit extra. So, so what you are saying is, in the moment, I'll be like, hey, baby, Spiwe wants to get inside. <laughs> For what? <laughs> Why would you call your penis? <laughs> I'm just thinking. I'm just thinking of rent. Okay, okay. Because it's okay. a lot. Okay. It's very generous. I see what you mean. I see what you mean. Ah, I get it. I get it. Okay. But okay, okay. Say so, something like the jackhammer would like to get inside. No, like, do you want some hammer? Aye, man. Okay, now, no, now, man. now, now, I would mind if my girlfriend named my my member. Yeah. Because girls come up with weird names. You see? No, All of a sudden it's Fluffy. Uh, ah, Princess Sophia. <laughs> Princess Sophia. <laughs> All of a sudden you've got a Disney <laughs> member. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. So, gang, gang. so I would rather I would rather name my own and then she 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 would use that name. Yeah. Um, the 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 name I would name mine or the name I gave mine is Mrenga. It red. Yes. It's what? Mrengareng. <laughs> It sounds Shangana. <laughs> it sounds Shangana. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It sounds like a disease in Malawi. <laughs> yo, 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 yo. Thank you, everyone, so, yo, for watching. Someone in Malawi is listening to that going, That's my uncle. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, sis, thank you for watching. This was his point of view. Away. Subscribe. Do the things. Yeah. Share the video. Yeah. All of the above. You know them. Don't act like you are new to YouTube, please. Yes. Yeah.